What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. I am of course CM Puma, wherever you may be, however you may be watching. Thanks for making this video a part of your day. We have moved up to Raw, and in the previous episode, we um, helped out some Samoa Joe and Stephanie McMahon by attacking Seth Rollins before his match with Samoa Joe. So it looks like we are full on company man. We are helping out the authority which is exactly what I wanted to do. Let's see what's in store for us here. Go speak with Todd Mullen in the production area. There's Roman Reigns and Mark Henry again. Oh, no. <laughs> I said Roman Reigns. That is not Roman Reigns. That is Nia Jax. Nobody here respects me. I do everything right, and what do I get in return? Nothing. Enough is enough. I'm done with the past. It's time for a new me that's only going to do what I want. I feel you, Naya. I'm, I'm right there with you. I am right there with you. Let's go see what's happening with Mr. Todd. Who's down here? We got some TJP. Anybody in authority in the authority office? Nope. I think I need to shave Puma's beard. Looks funny. Anybody here in the locker room? Hey, Kalisto. Let's see. Is it going to be in Spanish? You got the locker room on tilt after that. No one thinks they can trust you now. Oh, they can't. CM Puma cannot be trusted. We will attack at any moment. Shut up, TJ. Todd, what you got, my man? There you are. Great timing. What's going on? You seem super stressed. We're sort of in a bind right now. Could use your skills tonight. So the story goes, Mick made the stipulation that if Steph gets oh that if Seth gets ambushed before his match with Joe again, Joe will be stripped of his title. Not on my watch. What if it wasn't technically an ambush? Seth should just get good or go home already. If Seth can't stand up to Samoa Joe on his own in the ring, he doesn't deserve to be there. Hey, I wouldn't say that. Seth is a serious contender, but the company doesn't think that his time is now. Since Mick didn't say anything about going down during the match, our plans are heavy to, to strike then. Seth will probably still have his guard up before the match, but he definitely won't expect this. That's devious. I think Mick will be very careful how he phrases his stipulations next time. Pull this off and there won't need to be a next time. Once Joe's match is going strong, you get out there and make sure he doesn't lose. Make sure Samoa Joe wins the match. All right. I think I can do that. Ho ho ho! Don't worry about me. Don't you worry about me. Oh, that was quick. Oh, and a nice roll up there from Joe. Oh, rope break. Rope break, man. Where am I going? Nice job by Samoa Joe. Oh, I got you. I got you. Here we go. Here we go. Nice move there by Joe. So it looks back. like Joe is, is full control. Where he thrives. Yeah, we just got to make sure here, but that's to be Seth doesn't win. Especially considering who he's in the ring with. If things don't change in a hurry, this has all the makings of a short Flips him over. Jeez. Come on, Joe. Seth Rollins is one of the most complete competitors you'll I know you can do it. Joe WWE pumping himself up. Oh. Seth has a goal in sight. The man is unstoppable. Hey, you dummy. And nice move. Samo. Okay. I was going to say Samoa Joe gets it in good grief. Hey, hey. Uh-oh. That's no good. His drop kick finds the Jeez. Mark. Hey. Come over here. Talk to me while Samoa Joe recovers from not being able to reverse. There we go. Yeah, you didn't get out of that one. Oh, man. We're caution here with our exit gauge. We don't want, uh, we don't want to get kicked out. Nice. Knee breakers right there from Joe. Oh. What he wants. Seth has Joe's got his signature. We he, we need him to hit that beast. Nice rollout. And right back in he goes. 
Joe. German suplex, little cross arm German suplex. What is happening? There we go. And it's, what's Joe gonna be doing? He gotta hit that signature, Joe. Is this it? It is. Big senton. Holy cow. And now, Joe calling for the, for Seth Rollins to get to his feet. He's gonna hook it in right now. Hooked it in. Jeez. That could have been, that could have been it right there. Kicks to the face. There you go. Come on. Three. Very nice. Samoa Joe wins the matchup against Seth Rollins, and all we did was come down to bother him. Here is your winner, Samoa Joe. That's, that is how it goes. Yep, I didn't do much of anything. Okay, yeah, I'll get up there too. I'll get up there with you. That's it, man. CM Puma is a full-on company, man. Samoa Joe, what you got to say? Come here a second. I wanted to say I thought you did decent work tonight. Of course. It was great to help you. Whoa, whoa, don't get me wrong. I didn't need the help. I totally could have won him that match by myself. But hey, we knocked Seth off his game, and that's what matters. I deserve more credit than that. I deserve more credit for my contribution. I laid Seth out on a silver platter for you. More credit? I don't think so. That was my win. I appreciated you five seconds ago. Don't make me regret that. By the way, there's something I've been wanting to ask you. Shoot. How can I beat you? You can't best of the best. You said it. You can't best of the best. You said it. That can't happen. Well, I don't... Ha can't happen. Man, I, I don't even know what to say to this. Am I supposed to laugh? Or get offended? You seem serious. I don't know what makes you think you can even reach me. Tell you what, rise up the ranks and maybe, maybe when I retire, you'll have a chance. Fair? So hey, I've got a thing. Treat yourself to a drink and toast on me. Boy, Samoa Joe's a dick. Samoa Joe is a dick. Alright, let's get out of here real quick. Sorry if I called Nia Jax Roman Reigns. Who's this guy? Who is this? Who is it? Who is it? TJ4123. So you're going to ride Joe's coattails to the top. You can't do it on your own. Boy, I will punch you in the face. All right. Week three of January. And whoa, boy. Vincent Kennedy McMahon himself. I've been hearing some talk about you, new guy. Only great things, I hope. How are you, sir? Fantastic. Here you've been following the destroyer around. Helping out. Maybe learning a bit. Mostly just being there when needed. That's good. That's a decent start to your career, but let me give you a word of advice. Stop holding back. Aggression, ruthless aggression, goes a long, long way. I don't want to step on any toes. There are other ways to develop my career. I agree there hasn't been enough blood yet. You are 100% correct. There hasn't been enough blood yet, and I definitely have a bloodlust in me. I would suggest you let it out. If your tongue has a taste for that, let everyone know and let them know loudly. Quite frankly, you need to show more aggression or you won't survive here. Oh, I get it. It's comfortable in the shadow of Samoa Joe. Millennials and all that follows. Sheesh. Boy, Vince is fired up. You gotta have ambition and I hope you got that. Do you? Where do you want to go? A new place no one's been yet. Behind your desk. I'm gonna say that. Sir, I am aiming to claw my, my way to somewhere no one has been yet. A new place. How poetic. Or pointlessly mysterious. Any idea how that manifests? Not yet. I think I'll know it when I get there, though. I'm intrigued. We'll see what happens. Now, nobody wants to fail, obviously. You figure if you fail, you're exposed. From that standpoint, ambition is important. 
but so is aggression. Ruthless aggression. <laughs> Use a foreign object and win this match. Let's do it. Oh, man. Boy, Vince was cranked. All right. Production. Oop. Probably this way. Yep. Nope. Wait, wait. Man, we're already on the other side of the world. Fast forward. All right. Oh. Snap. It's Seth. Let's look at the match card. Cesaro versus Carl Anderson. Dean versus Enzo. Mark Henry versus Dash. Boy, look at Bo Dallas. Eek. Roman Reigns versus Big Cass. Well, we get to finally brawl with Seth. Oh, get off your phone. Uh. Uh, not today. Oh, look, a chair. That chair is what Mr. McMahon said to use on Seth Rollins. Uh-oh. Dang. Oh, man, what a backbreaker that was. Come on, Seth. Too late. Come on, 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 come on. Get off. Okay, I can't see. Here we go. Shoot. Reversal from Seth. The DDT. And this keeps flip-flopping back and forth, and it's screwing everything up. Get off me. I can't reverse, apparently. So I gotta get a move in on him. Dang. This is, like, ridiculous. Ugh. That's right. Dude. I thought he was reversing us. Hooking it up. Oh, man. DDT. Onto the, the hard concrete back there. Where are you swinging, Puma? Jeez. That just crumpled Seth like a sack of potatoes. Dude, are you for real? No reversals, though, so that's good. Here, eat Dr. Teeth. Oh, man, that damn hurricane pose. We're going to pick him up. Big brain buster on the outside. Give me this chair. Oh, he scooted. And he took it. How? He has zero reversals. Yeah. Man. That is annoying. Come on now. You know better. Got him up. Oh, the DDT again. All right, that apparently is all we can do. Let's get this full. Oh, man. I'm trying to, now I'm actually trying to get him to use a reversal. Hooking him up. Big Northern Lights. Because I got my signature and I, I need to, I want to use it on him. Boom. You know what, follow me here into the locker room into the locker room, why don't you? There we go. Oh, okay. We're just gonna throw him smooth outside the locker room. Dang it. Okay, I'll take that. Oh, turn around, Puma! Shoot. Onto the steel chair. Now he's got a super kick. Dead. D -d -d -d. Steel chair in hand. No, we rolled out of the way. Yeah. Boom. Kick to the face and come on. Do not reverse my signature or my finisher. Don't do it. He didn't do it. Ah. Uh. That wasn't enough to take him out? Give me a chair. We're about to go 50 shades of beating Seth Rollins' ass with this chair. 
Man. Not what I wanted. Oh. Shit. I'm out of reversals, and now he's got a signature. Dang it. I mean, he's got a finisher, and this is not going to end well. If I lose right now, I'm going to be pissed. Oh, look at that. Catching Seth Rollins with the head scissors. Very nice. Oh, we're exhausted. We are wiped out. Here's a briefcase. Give me the briefcase. Stand up. Oh, jeez. Straight out blasting Seth Rollins. Dang it. And we just got to avoid the knee. Or anything like that. Dang it. I better not lose off of this. I've been whooping that ass. Thank goodness. Thank goodness. All right, come on. No. Dang, I'm out of stamina. There we go. Backstabber. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Uh, nice. This has got to be it for Rollins. Thank goodness. I was putting a beating on that boy. You, yeah, you better hold me back. I've had enough of Seth Rollins. What you got to say? Hey, no match for you tonight. Take a breather while you can. You should go talk to Stephanie, though. She wanted to see you. And I don't want to steal any of her thunder. She looks like she's in a really good mood tonight. Look at you, only three weeks in and you've got her beaming. Some kind of record that. Okay, she's not in there. Is she in the other authority locker room or is she just hanging out in the, I mean the other authority office? Or is she in the parking lot? What up Gary? That's Gary Coleman, I assume. There's Dana Brooke. She's not. Steph's not in catering. I doubt she's in the parking lot. Just hanging out. Whoa! Okay, well, Vince is. There's Bray Wyatt. There's Apollo Crews. There's the lady. Vince, you want to get my car? If you love your job, you'll leave my site right now. Let's go talk to Bray. Ooh, this dude is crazy looking. Management's been pretty uptight lately. Be careful not to run afoul of them. Then again, maybe do it. We're in a business run on excitement. Sometimes it's good to shake up things up. Just don't get in over your head. Sister Abigail, follow the buzzards. I'm the eater of worlds kind of thing. All right. Let's go check the authority office. There she is. There's the billion dollar princess. Oh. There he is. The go-getter I wanted to show up. I try to be where I'm wanted. I'll say, you know, you're quickly becoming accustomed to things around here and then focusing on what is important. My instincts are second to none. I've trained for a long time to exist right here, right now. My instincts are guiding me and I'll keep on following them. Sounds like a plan, but don't lose focus. When it's between your instincts and my calls, your best bet is on me. In that case, I won't go wrong. You won't. Basically, it's simple. I wanted to take a moment to tell you that you've been doing a great job. You aren't the first to do things you've done, but you have a spirit that they don't. I want you to know that it shows. Keep this up, and we might give you more TV time. Would that interest you? Absolutely. What are you talking about, Steph? There's a couch over there. I'll do anything you want me to do. Of course it would. All right. Is that it? Speak with Mr. McMahon in the parking lot. I did. He told me to get out of his sight. He told me to get out of his sight. Right, let's see what he has to say. 
Now, if it isn't the not-so-prodigal son. Look, I'm on my way out, but let's chat. Of course. Oh, fired up. Turns out you're listening to me, attentively. I saw what you did out there tonight. Ruthless. It's funny. I kept hearing this phrase you told me repeating and repeating over and over in my mind until, until it couldn't contain itself. Fantastic. It's no secret that I've grown some of the de facto best megastars in the WWE. From our tar talk earlier, I know you are dreaming big. I am, sir. Keep your ears open and listen to my directions, and you will be on the top in no time. Count on it. I know it hasn't been a long time yet, but thanks for all your support. Likewise, I'm sure. Good night, son. Good night, Dad. I'll see you tomorrow. Oh, and one more thing. Call me Mr. McMahon. <laughs> okay, well, I think that's going to wrap up this video. Um, there's a lot happening, a lot going on. We're we're like the company man. We got the McMahons on our side, which is fantastic. So, I think we're uh, I think we're on a good track here. So, leave a like if you enjoyed this video. Subscribe if you're not. We head into the first week of February. Let's see what's in store of us. We'll see you soon.